Steve, I know you said you hadn't quite been able to put the fire out since the Derby defeat against Newcastle. Could this do it today? <laughs> well, I hope so. We've got another home game and then we've got a nice easy game against Man U the following week after that. I, that's that's been you know that's been the trouble you know since the since the derby defeat we haven't been able to to qualify if you like and uh, we needed a few results thankfully um, today has been one of them days where we've thoroughly deserved it and we have done we haven't played badly all season you know we've probably played badly once which was Norwich but we haven't got the results that maybe our performances have justified so today um, hopefully things have changed and turned round and uh, let's let's hope we can go on a bit of a run. Did you ever think the goal was coming in the no, second half? We had so much pressure. I don't cannot remember being away from home and being so dominant, you know, against a, another Premier League team. You know, we had masses of corners and free kicks and shots on target, but we needed that little killer touch and uh, thankfully little Cess has popped up and, and we finished it off right at the death. Connor Wickham's first start for the club alongside Nicholas Bentner today. What did you make of what Connor did? Well, I thought the longer the game went on, the better he became. And uh, I think everybody who's watched the game today can see the talent of the lad. And we, it was important that we protected him. A lot of people have been clamouring for him. And it was important that we do protect him, that he is ready. And, we, and we've tried to bring him into the club and give him three, four months so he can assess what the North East's like and what it's like to play for our club and what it's like to play in the Premier League. But if that's anything to go by, then he's got a big future. How important is it that he can put back-to-back -back successes now? Well, that's the difficulty of the Premier League, can we? We've got a big game now at home to, to Villa. Um, you know, we've given ourselves a ni nice platform. You know, it's, uh, it'd be nice to see the table tonight rather than being at the towards where we want to be. And uh, that's important. If you can go back to back, it's, it's, uh, it's a great thing. Great support here today. 4,000 fans have made the, the journey to Bolton. They gave you a good reception at the end, which must have been a, a relief for you. Well, well, I mean, them people who came today, you know, they, they are your real, real support. There's not many clubs can bring 4,500 when you, you know, we were fourth bottom of the league this morning. We could have gone bottom. But 4,500 have come here in, in tough times. And that's one of the reasons why I came to the club, even though you know, you're know so-called under pressure and all this nonsense. We've got a great support, a unique support, and it's always been my aim to give them a team which they can be proud of. And I still think we're making big strides and improving, and uh, hopefully we can get a few results to prove that.